Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Dizzysaurus back with another review today. Uh, today we are reviewing uh, Aidan McGeady. He's an absolute sensational player. He has five star skills. I was playing him up front purely down to the fact that I used him in the St. Patrick's Cup up front and I was used to him playing there. So uh, he was absolutely sensational for me up front. So I'm sure he's just as good on the wing. But he did score seven, 16 goals in seven games and he has five star skills, four star weak foot. He is absolutely amazing. Up front, he's probably one of my favourite players in the world on this game. As you can see, his in-game stats there, guys. Absolutely crazy in-game stats. Very complete. Especially his physical stats, guys. Uh, they were very good. He is a higher medium, which is very good. Look at his uh, acceleration there. 94, which is absolutely amazing. A 92, 92 sprint speed. He's got a 91 aggression. Uh, but his pace, guys, was absolutely crazy. Uh, his pace was second to none. For me, he's the best right mid with five-star skills on the game. Obviously, you've got your, your players like Ben Arthur, Maya Conley-80, Kelvin, Danilio, and a few other players amongst them. But uh, for me, Aidan McGinney is uh, much better than all of them, from, in my opinion. <clears throat> His pace is absolutely uh, electric. He uh, turns and switches uh, switches paces uh, left, right and centre. He's a very, very quick player. His dribbling was second to none, guys. His uh, dribbling was unbelievable. Look at that goal there. That was a beautiful volley as well. But uh, back to his dribbling, it was absolutely crazy. Every little turn was just beautiful. It worked. He can do the scoop turn as well, uh, which is uh, very, very good. Uh, any five-star skill skiller that's able to do that is top-notch, especially when you have a five-star player wet playing way up the pitch on the wing, on up front, whatever you do, guys. He is absolutely sensational, and he will be banging in you uh, in the goals. The standout feature for me was his finishing. My God, his finishing was just amazing, guys. I could not believe how good his finishing was. He was shooting from long distance. Look at this goal there. Absolutely crazy long distance shots. And he was scoring from close corners, near post with his left and right foot. Uh, he was quite good at free kicks as well. Unfortunately, I didn't score with him. But uh, all round, he was a very, very complete player. I would definitely recommend playing him higher up the pitch rather than in a 3-5-2 at right mid because I feel he'd be wasteful there, which is the reason why I was putting him up front because I used him in the St. Patrick's Cup uh, when, uh, when the uh, Irish League came out and uh, he was very, very good for me there and in game five I come across this uh, decent team here Whits in from the corner and there's a goal there's an assist on his tally which is a uh, very very good for me his weakness was his heading it wasn't all that but then Aidan McGeady's not known for his heading but I have to be nitpicky here and uh, pick out his weaknesses and that was his weakness for me uh, but all round he was absolutely complete he was scoring all sorts of goals. He sort of scored 16 goals for me up front, guys, and that is crazy for any striker to score in that many uh, that many goals there. What a beautiful sliding goal there, which was a very good tidy finish uh, with his left foot. Um, and also, guys, he uh, he was a uh, good volley there, which was uh, absolutely fantastic. Uh, all round, guys, he did cost me 130 grand, uh, which it wasn't a lot. He is actually more expensive at the moment. I believe he's going for around uh, just under 200k at the moment. But I did uh, pick him up on a bargain, and I was the first person to pick him up. So I was very excited to do a pink slip on him earlier. If you haven't watched it, guys, make sure you check that shit out. That was a crazy game. Uh, but overall, guys, this guy is one of the best players with five-star skills I've used. Ronaldo and uh, Aidan McGeady together. Oh, my days. That is an amazing team on each wing, guys, if you're able to pull that off. Anyway, guys, check this goal out here. What a top goal, goal that was into the top corner. But overall, guys, I'm going to take you into the in-game stat, uh, overall stats here. Uh, his five-star skills, finishing, dribbling, pace, and passing was his standout features for me. And his uh, heading did let him down, uh, which was unfortunate. But obviously, everyone's got a weakness in some stage. He's not incredible Hulk. But anyway, guys... Uh, as always, please like, subscribe and comment and uh, what you thought about this episode. And uh, if you haven't already, make sure you follow me on Twitter. The link will be in the description below. And as always, guys, it's been amazing having you. Peace out.